It was back in 1997 the Licking River rose past its banks and flooded much of Cynthiana. Well, more than 20 years later, there's a push to redevelop an area once full of homes before that flooding. However, a thief or thieves caused a glitch in the project when they stole a valuable piece of construction equipment. Lee Searcy has the story. The flood of 97 hit hard and fast, and while many homes and businesses bounced back, not every street around Cynthiana rebounded. And for the last 20 years, it's just been empty lots down here. But the Cynthiana mayor says West Mill Street is showing life again, now that the city is working with a group to build homes for families that need a little help. Cha-Cha, a Cynthiana Harrison County Home Assistance nonprofit, has been on a roll building this fourth home. But recently, the project came to a brief stop when someone stole an expensive generator. For whatever reasons, you know, it, it uh, disappeared. It was locked and secured on a trailer over here. So if you find one that's bright yellow and the meter doesn't work, that's probably ours. Bobby Duncan, a local pastor, hopes the thief has a change of heart. You can bring it back. You can set it down somewhere. Maybe you didn't understand that we were helping other people that needed a hand up and not just a handout. So good things do prevail. With or without the generator, the job will get done. There will be a big build-a-thon Saturday, September 15th. So if you want to help, come on out to West Mill Street. The mayor has a message for the thief or Scrooge. This house here, we're hoping to get a family in it by Christmas. That's going to be their Christmas present, and you're not going to steal Christmas this year from this family. Covering the news in Harrison County, Lee Searcy, LEX 18 News.